Hey guys, Musk is back with some Splinter Cell Blacklist today and I'm playing on the PC. Uh, I've spared you all of the uh, the introductory sort of cutscenes and things like that and I'm going to get straight into the gameplay. So this is where you first uh, pick up control. This is actually a game that was uh, donated to me by a mate and his name is Rusty Nichols. So i got to say thank you very much for giving me this game and uh, I have tested it. Just in this area here, I've just fired it up and tried a, different, a few different graphical settings just to make sure it runs pretty well. So uh, everything is pretty much well maxed running on DX11 with uh, tessellation. The only thing I've disabled is uh, the anti-aliasing because uh, it really, really uh, makes a huge uh, performance impact when I have anti-aliasing along with the tessellation. And uh, with the tessellation, because it smooths all the corners down every way, uh, anyway, uh, you'll find that anti-aliasing is almost not necessary. So it looks quite good and uh, we're gonna get into it. So what has happened is the Air Force base, I believe, was just attacked. And now we were caught up in the explosion and we have uh, crashed our helicopter nearby. So what we're gonna try and do is, I don't know, make our way back to the base or find out what's going on. Oh! <laughs> there it is, the Anderson Air Force Some Base. Katushas. Oh, I hear bullets. Right LS to crouch, okay. I think we'd, we'd be fairly easily spotted. <laughs> I think that guy would have just killed us. Game over, thank you. <laughs> Alright, I'm using the Xbox 360 controller as well so I can sit back and actually play lights on your gear flare when you're in shadow I can actually play it with the controller the only thing is I don't know whether it's working properly oh no well, that's a bit violent <laughs> poor bastard okay all clear when do I get some weapons at the start they said the mission was uh, the mission we were supposed to go on was weapon free oh, I gotta boost him up. And he gave me a Karam bit, which is like a, a knife, so... Oh, there we go, teamwork. i got to be honest, I've never actually played a Splinter Cell game before. I was huge into the Metal Gear Solid games, uh, but this is something that I never got into. A lot of friends were playing Splinter Cell, and I was always like, ah, nah, the uh, Metal Gear's heaps better. Why aren't you climbing? I'm pushing A. Oh, there we go. Oh, can I, can I Assassin's Creed it? No. To the left. To the left. <laughs> what a, there we go. Up. Oh, stealth. Oh, B. B. Oh, yeah, we're stealth. We're stealth. Aim at next cover and tap A to... Oh, okay. Oh, that's pretty smooth. That's... you got real limited camera movement, though. That's really sort of heavy and clunky. Let's get that camera going. Yeah, just give me a second. They need to get that corporal down here. This guy looks dead already. Yeah. Hold on. Oh, that's yeah, still. Roll the camera. Is room. Selection wheel. Oh, okay. <laughs> we going lethal, baby. So what? Do I, how do I kill him? Oh, okay. Maybe I should just push X to kill. Hey. Derp. <laughs> oh, right in the neck. Oh, he bad. You know he bad. But he's not going anywhere if they're blocking cars. Oh, okay. I'll stabilize him. You take out the mark targets. All right, Vic. Good luck. Oh, okay. He's saving that dude. All right. So it's me, is it? All right. I think this is probably the tutorial section, and I I don't think that it'll say cover like that for all of the all of the things. Oh, you can move on cover. All right. Man, it actually runs really smooth. I'm getting solid frames per second. Hopefully the recording will show just how smooth it is. See dudes over there. Can I so I can't go that far. Oh I can switch between so I can go side to side. Now I can go back to that one. Oh! Triggered explosions. Love it. <laughs> I can climb over it. It's looking like this is the way to go. I just saw a dude here before. How many are here? 
Oh, you guys are dead. You did. <laughs> I've got the audio turned right down, so it's hard for me to hear uh, when I'm recording. I, I knock the game audio right down. I'll have to turn it back up, but I won't do that just yet. Look at these dudes are just fixing stuff. There's two there, one there. Oh, there's a stack of guys over there. Let's get over here. Look at this, man. We, we stealth. Oh, this guy's dead. You know he's dead. Oh, RB to mark targets. Oh, you're marked. Now you did. Oh, I didn't even know how I did that. <laughs> yeah, can I kill him? How do I kill him? Oh, I snapped his neck off. My goodness. All right. Oh, I wanted to like just go up and execute him. Maybe it's Y to execute. It says Y to execute there, but then when you tap it. You gotta hit RB to mark a target. Maybe I have to mark him and then tap Y. It's looking like this is a way to go because that is all fairly lit up over there. Let's see how we go. I think if we kill him, the other guy would not. Oh, unless we can take him hostage and then shoot that other dude. We might actually just try and stealth it, actually. <laughs> I don't want to alert everyone. Oh, how stealth are we? So they wouldn't hear anything, man. They're unsilenced weapons. Oh, here we go. I can't see me, really? You idiot! Oh, why is it vibrate? How do I get out of cover? Oh, there we go. I'm cool, I'm cool. Relax, oh no. Oh, if he comes over here, I'm gonna have to kill this guy. Get in here, get in here. No, don't climb! No! <laughs> I wanted to get in cover! Oh, no! Damn it! Well. That was a mission failure. Oh, sucker. All right. All right. Let's, let's do it again. Oh, no wonder I stuffed that up. Okay. All right. I, was, I stuffed it up. I was pushing A to get into cover. So it's B to get into cover, and it's A to transition between cover points. Okay. That's where I stuffed up there. I got it now. I'm cool. <laughs> oh, so I could just pop up cap these dudes too. Oh, we could probably go that way. All right, let's try another another way. What's this guy doing? Look at my eye on you, buddy. You look like the bad guys from Max Payne 3. <laughs> oh, God. I don't think we can kill him because he's too close to the other guys. I'll probably notice. I'll probably notice the dude just die. <laughs> oh, I could have just capped him. So is he in charge? Are you the boss, man? Okay. Stay out of the light, though, because that's lit up there. I don't know whether we'll be seen. Oops. Did we get him? Did we stealth him? Oh, we gotta pick up his body, pick up his body. <laughs> oh, that guy seen me! Stay here! It's cool! Oh, do you even lift? Every day! <laughs> Alright, we'll just we'll keep him with us for now. It's cool, man, we gotta hide him in this corner. <laughs> Stay down! Alright, B, yeah, there we are, now we're in cover. So the jam is out there. Looks like we gotta try and get past this guy. Oh, we're still in the shadows. I think if the green light's on, it must mean we're, sh we're shadowed and we can't be seen. You think they'd see the, the really bright green LED <laughs> glowing on your back, though? <laughs> okay, come here, come here. Oh no! Damn it! Oh, I made it! Yes! You didn't see anything. I see the guy with the grenade. Oh, there was a cutscene at the start where uh, they left the dude with a grenade. I think that's him. Yeah, it is. He's got it in his hand. 
know how to disable that thing? I'm working on it. How's the kid? Don't ask. Charlie, we're in. I said, right, don't right. ask. No do questions. Where? <laughs> Just hold still. No talking, okay? Charlie, how about an on-off switch? Uh, do you see a blue button? Yeah. Hit it. What are you saying? Hit it. What are you telling me, buddy? What are you telling me? Jeez. Jammer's offline, Vic. You can't stop the blacklist. Grenade! He's a baddie! Oh, did he save me? He sacrificed himself to have a drink. Oh, we got a female. Word of a stunning attack on the massive U.S. military installation on the island of Guam. The deadliest strike. Oh, okay, yeah. So that was that was the introduction to the game. All right. So that is like the tutorial section. So now I, I imagine the game would start. Oh, I got a lot of hits on YouTube there, man. Two hundred fifty million. Oh, nasty. Headshot. Headshot. <laughs> America. This is the blacklist. blacklist. America. Attack this is the Mandarin. We have one <laughs> demand. You have soldiers in 153 countries. Bring your troops home. Your troops home. Now. 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 Every week, we, we will, will attack you. you. We will not negotiate. You will not stop the blacklist. The blacklist. You have seven days until the next attack. The, the choice, choice is yours. We, we are, are the engineers. engineers. We are the engineers. Bam! Blacklist What's in your stars? face. Paladin one in the fourth <laughs> echelon team. Oh, look at it. It's Iron Man three. The game. I'm telling you. His friend is fighting for his life. Find Victor Cost. You'll find Sam. Hundreds dead in Guam. A countdown to more attacks targeting America. Oh, that was his mate, was it? For answers, Mr. Fisher, and I don't have any. Is that Hillary Clinton? Fourth Echelon needs to find them, and I can't do that without a leader. It's distraught, Vic. Sam Fisher, A.K.A. Tony Stark. One of Vic's men comes with me. No questions asked. You can have Charlie Cole. Charlie Cole, A.K.A. War Machine. And Grimm's daughter has <laughs> It is. I'm telling you, I'm going to do this the whole time I'm playing. <laughs> Isaac Let's try and find colorations. Grim is out. Oh, he looked like he was a dude from Crisis. See his nano either. suit. Sorry, Sam. That's a non-starter. Nobody works better with you than she does. Pepper Potts. Welcome to Fourth Echelon, <laughs> Mr. Fisher. <laughs> I should stop. Loading data. So are we playing the game? Oh, it's in in-game engine now. Graphics are pretty good. They suffer from that. Pretty sweet, right? video game sort of lifeless like robotic animation so that's the problem deeper with this engineers organization be interesting to see i think because with the next generation of like playstation 4 and xbox one coming out this is basically what games on that are going to look like so for people that have high-end pc systems they've already seen basically what the next generation is going to look like I think it's all going to come down to developer creativity at the end as to what they can do with uh, with that new new hardware because it's not really even new hardware I suppose. Loaded with custom modifications. Yeah, that's a big uh, what is it? Microsoft Surface. That's huge. That you'd have on the ground. Fully mobile. It's like the good old days. Problem breaks. Just got my subdermal radio put in. Felt like someone used a jackhammer. Bricks. This probably makes Air Force One look like a paper airplane. Hey Sam. Do you want to discuss potential upgrades? Later. Walk me through this. News and internet data mining. Predicted I'd love to have a house that had a setup like that. <laughs> you invite your friends around for drinks. You're like, this is my uh, living room. They'd be like, what? <laughs> this is the shit. This is what you were bragging about? Yes, am I? Strategic mission interface. We've made significant improvements since the early system Charlie worked on. I'll let him get you up to speed. The best thing is... You can control everything from right here or from your opsat when you're on the ground. Hexagons, man, look at that. you got to have hexagons okay, well, in any technological looking game nowadays. Dicks. Thanks, Charlie. Your shirt's got to be made of hexagons as well. Oh, we're back in control? Look at him, man. Hello, I am Samuel Fisher. <laughs> See? See if we can get a look at these hexagons. Yeah, hexagons, man. Let's talk to this guy. Nope. It's kind of feeling like Mass Effect now, actually. Welcome to the Normandy. Hey, Charlie's got some new gear he's working on. 
cool. I better go get it then. Man, it is. It's just like Mass Effect. <laughs> oh, we'll talk to the talk to her. What's, what's, Grim. what's up? Listen, Sam. We have a lot of work ahead of us. Thought maybe we should clear the air. History is history. That's it. Like you it's got um got a good lip sync. Plane upgrades back. Grim missions. Solo co-op. Okay. Upgrade to plane, yo. <laughs> oh, what we can upgrade to plane? Oh, I can move in the menu now. Before I couldn't move in the menu. Wow, we can do heaps of stuff. Okay. <laughs> All right. I'll have to look into that. Give me both. We go. Something just came in from a contact in Benghazi. I'll follow up with you later. Thanks, man. Thanks. Benghazi. We were just there the other day. Let's have a walk around. We, we've got no mission objective. It looks like we probably have to talk to people and then they all have different little missions. Damn it. Set up Here we go. Complete, Charlie. Yeah, hang on. Ow. Ah! Hey. Hey, Sam. We're uh, pretty much good to go here. Just got to overclock a couple of components and then see if my supply rack gets approved by Her Majesty. Overclock Let a couple of components? Any... Okay. Shut up. Pretty tricked out workshop, huh? I'll be able to upgrade and repair most of our equipment and if we've got enough cash and the right supplies, then I can test out some sick mods for your gear. Sounds like we're in good hands. You know so, it. we get cash, hey, we get sick right mods. Yeah. <laughs> sick mods. Overclock suits. Thanks. <laughs> it's creepy how it goes into that. Just look at his face, man. That guy looks like he's just staring me to death. I am trying to melt you with my face. Customized gear. He's got missions as well, Max. Max? Where did I see Max? Oh, oh back. Customized gear, so what can we do? Oh, look at that. It's pretty badass. Oh, what? <laughs> look at that. He's a tank. Okay. Campaign. Let out B, let out C. Oh, it looks like there's heaps I could get into. Man. I just, I want to play the game. I want to go and shoot some stuff. I'll have to look up. Oh, that looks like a portal gun on there. No, it's nothing. <laughs> All right, what I might do is I'll leave it there. Uh, this is just really an introduction just to show you what it looks like and what it runs like uh, on my system. I might do a little bit with it. I might just record a mission here and there and uh, see how it goes. I imagine it's a fairly large game because it was a 20 gigabyte uh, download. It was absolutely massive. So I, I imagine there's quite a lot of gameplay. I don't honestly have the time to put in to do a full uh, let's play but i might do a few videos here and there with it oh is this is oh okay i can customize here as well all right <laughs> i hope you enjoyed that brief introduction to splinter cell blacklist and uh thanks again to the rusty nickel for donating this game to me anyway guys till the next video we'll see you later